So then, Obi-Wan, after your accurate prediction on Christmas tragedy, what can I expect for the new year? I think you can expect a hangover and a lot of girls to turn you down. I, on the other hand, generally contrive to do something heroic this time of year. Yeah, but there's a new sheriff in town. I'm the hero now. I think you should be worried about what frock you're going to wear tonight, sweetie. Oh. Here's your hand. No, right here. I've been really been badly beaten, localised to pain. Let's get him into Pete's, please. That's 97%, pulse 70, BP 150, systolic, GCS 7. Can you squeeze my hand, please? You know where you are? This is crazy. Who'd do something like there's this? Some animals out there, Toby. Well, there's an obvious recent thoracotomy scar. Can you chase x-ray, please? Yeah. Do you think it'll be all right? Toby, I think we've got enough people here, OK? Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Do we have a name? No, no, no idea. Looks like old father time to me. Who? Whatever happened to tradition? Old father time represents the passing year. What's the point? Well, somebody's had a real good go at ending this year. Fracture to nose, mandible, bruising to chest and abdomen, obvious college deformity to left wrist. Mr Jordan, yeah. sorry, there's a journalist. I don't think he'll be talking any time soon. No, he wants to talk to the doctor who rescued him. Oh. Well, Toby is being an invaluable help, but I'm sure we can spare him. Accidental hero, Tobes. Come on, then. Please need to shock him. Sudden collapse. Be on the monitor. No pulse. Can I do anything? Yes. Can I help? Get out of the way. Oh. Stand back. Charging. Get out of the way. Clear. What is going on? Still no rhythm. Charging again. Clear. Back in business. We got a pulse. Good. Can you do obs, please? That looks sore. Patient's refusing analgesia. What? I need to be at the airport. Well, I'm afraid that's not possible right now. My name's <sighs> Dr. Winters. You're in Holby City Emergency Department. You can listen to your chest. Okay? I'm apparently not worth introducing, but for the record, staff nurse Faldron and the pretty girl removing your clothes. No, I need to leave. Well, so that's not advisable right now. You just do yourself more damage. What's your name, mate? It's Ledley. What's the emergency, Ledley? I need to meet someone at the airport. Well, don't wait. Just ring them. Try and keep still. I, I can't. Be... I don't speak English that well. Oh, OK. Well, you lay still and let Dr Winters examine you and we'll be as quick as possible. Uh, can someone please ring the airport? I will. Right, no guarding, no definite indications of internal bleeding. Chai Lai. Her name's Chai Lai. Flight Jewett from Bangkok. She, she doesn't speak English that well. Right, let's get the surgeons down anyway, just to take a look. Uh, we need you to rest now, Ledley. Oh, sorry. No need to apologise. Right, let's keep the glass in till he's had the scan. Oh, how long will that be? As long as it takes. She's a really nice girl. Oh, I bet she is. We'll do a fast scan, find the ultrasound machine. Uh, I was just going to make the call. Alice? She doesn't speak English. She's flying in from Thailand. He is a fat, ugly, sweaty man. Find the scanner, then make the call. Mm. Oh, sorry. I've drawn the short straw, though. Mm. Nice. Yeah, look, I'll catheterise him. You can just leave, hmm? please. Go on, it's fine. Go. OK. Who do you reckon? Am I missing something? It's for the staff party. Where are you going? Oh, right. Uh, yeah, I thought I'd pop in. Give you a dancing lesson. We wearing? Wearing? I didn't know it was fancy dress. No, it's themed. Oh, it's themed. Nautical but nice. Whatever happened to good old fashioned parties? You just dressed up a bit, had a real band. <laughs> oh, it was just after the war. We had real butter. Shut up. You were great. Shut up. Hey, hello, Grandad. What's all this? You want to try watching a decent film once in a while? Errol Flynn. I'm Errol. This is Flynn. Sorry, you've lost me. Not too many showed up then. No, but it's uh, early doors yet, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Psst. Hey. Hello, Dr. Strangelove. How are we? What, is it a race or something? Well, that's just plain rude.
gay. You always have been. You flat magic. You panic. You make unwise decisions. Uncharacteristic. If you wish to hand in your notice, I accept. Always look out for number one. Because nobody else will. What's happening? The drowning. Old Father Time. He took her off to the woods. The police are looking at the homeless community for a gay. Flat ways to have me. You make your gay decisions. Always have There are no happy ever afters. There is no future for me. Toby, come on! Come on, swim me! It'll all end in tears. What will? Listening at doors. You never hear anything good about yourself. Uh, did they mention me? Why would they? Well, I'm the hero of the hour. Isn't there a bedpan needs emptying? Or... <laughs> Not exactly a people person, are you, Dr. Winters? Reliable, heroic, some kind of sixth sense. It's like I knew. Oh, well, I know. Don't you worry. I've done my fair share of the hero stuff. Right, yeah. I'm, I'm sure there's loads of people alive today thanks to you taking their temperature. And the rest, Sonny Jim, and the rest. I acknowledge your manliness, Gramps. It's just that there's man and there's Superman. You know what I'm saying? Oh, and that would be you, would it? Superman. You got your tickets? What for? For the gun show. Mmm. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, what are you doing? Please, no, what's the way? You're cheating. How am I cheating? I don't know. It's an experience, man. Incoming. Lots of them. Time out. Hey. It's going to be a busy day. Oh, come on, lads, man. It's... Toby, is it true you're finishing today? Nice one, mate. Life's too short to waste it working out notices. Where are you going? It's a nice badge. <laughs> Charlie made it for me. No, I did not. One of the junior nurses did. Anyway, uh, you can stop thanking me now, Toby. It's getting a little bit embarrassing. Excuse me, I thought you were meant to be fetching some more cannulas. Jawohl, Herr Fekoff. Toby! Hey, this is not a cattle market. Uh, can you find Toby and tell him to get rid of his patient from my patient's cubicle? OK. Right, where do you want this one? Can't just move a patient. Hey, hey, don't shoot the messenger. Oh, she's being unreasonable. I mean, look. All my patients are on this side. It's the nurses that are allocating them. <laughs> Miss Jenkins can be discharged. Huh? It's all an ankle. Uh, X-rays are back, can't see a break, but then I am on your nest. Which brings me back to ask, what are we going to do with Mr Stevens? Is that? Head trauma. Oh, Because yeah. he, he's back from a scan. Right, um, what, what, what are the results? Uh, I don't know, you've got them there. Mr Wilkinson, open fracture to right arm, tachycardic at 127, BP 110 to stolid, GCS 15 throughout, where do you want him? Oh, next, Doc, I'm in bloody agony, yeah? Sorry, what, one at a time, please. Take the bull by the horns, Doc. Jay, yes. Can you take this patient to cubicle one? One, thank you. And I'll look into Mr. Head. Stevens. Stevens, thank you, Kelsey. Oh, small maniacs is not in my job description. Dr. Winters, we're getting a little backed up in here. Yeah, I know, Jay. It'll be fine. My biggest concern at the moment is a young girl refusing treatment. Please say that. How young? Eight, maybe. No way, she's like 10 or 11. Are you kidding me? What, what needs doing? Uh, suturing, but I need to anesthetize the area first. OK? No woman on earth can resist a compliment. Yeah, we're, we're all that shallow. Hey, Ruth, uh... ah! <laughs> Look, Ruth, I know Look, you're busy, but... Prior... Left just yet. Fracture's on his way to x-ray, but there's two patients not even assessed yet. Right, where are they? In admin, on their trolleys. Close to being off them. Oh, dear. Hey, try and crush my hand. What? Go on, hard man, try and crush it. Bet your ten I don't say a word. Oh, we're in the middle of a major situation here. Uh, here, row. I'm on top of it, mate. These people have been in a train crash. They do not need comedy badges. What? It raises morale. It's Robert. Mr Jenkins' nosebleed ain't stopping. What was the name of that head trauma again? Stevens. God, I can still taste that river water, can't you? Yeah. Um, look, I've got one more thing to do, then I'll see to Mr Stevens. 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 Thanks for saving my life, though, Jay. Oh, you're welcome, Tobes. Don't mention it. Oh, you didn't. Winters, we've got a restrainer for our own benefit. I think we should just use a blow dart. Social services are on their way. I'm going to tell him you said that. Toby's going to have a go. Oh. Yeah, well, uh, stay away from the mouth. But it's all right, he's got a plan. Wish me luck.
Apparently his GP used to do it. Do what? I'm 11. See? It. Come on. Okay, Grandma, you got a name? What? Mr. Jenkins. No, 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 no. Come on, look, I did really well with my last patient. Can we just leave it there? Sorry, mate, you're not quite finished yet. Yeah, uh, Foldy catheter, please, now. Yeah. His nasal packs aren't reaching the bleeding point. Right, do you want to wait for your interview? No, 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 I can do this. OK. OK, this is going to be a little bit uncomfortable. Bear with me. OK. Yeah. I think that's got it. It stopped. Yeah. Nice one. It's in the book. Don't do that. Hold on, mate. I've got it. Jay, you okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. Changed a bit, but we love you still. Wait. Half half. Got me. Oh. Oh. Who's stronger, Miriam? Shut. <laughs> Take it easy, big man. Uh, Jay. Uh, I'm gonna say. Thank you. God, finally. My pleasure.